approximately 1,500 species of fish, 4,000 species of mollusks, 500 species of coral, 215 species of birds, 16 species of sea snakes, and 6 species of sea turtles at the Great Barrier Reef. Littering. When people litter in the streets, the wind usually takes it and gets it washed down the drain pipe and it ends up in the Great Barrier Reef. The rubbish kills the marine animals and the wildlife around it because things such as six-pack rings get caught around animals' necks and suffocate them. A big one is plastic bags. Turtles think they are jellyfish, eat them and die. Rubbish also ends up there when it is dumped overboard. Coral bleaching. Coral bleaching is when the coral loses all its colour and turns white. This occurs when polyps are stressed. The polyps get stressed due to things such as global warming because it rises the water temperature. The zooanthel, also known as algae, is within the tissues of the polyp and when the polyps get stressed it spits it out. If the zooanthel does not rebuild, the coral will die. Climate change. Global warming. Global warming is caused by pollution, methane, greenhouse emissions and more. Global warming causes the earth to be hotter, which is not good news for the Great Barrier Reef because it warms up the water and causes coral bleaching. If the global warming continues, the reef will, not, will only live for another 20 to 30 years. Tourists. Many tourists come to visit the Great Barrier Reef because it is such a beautiful sight and they go scuba diving. But when they go scuba diving, they are stepping on the coral and ruining it, or they are breaking bits off as souvenirs. This is not good because it ruins the reef and kills some of the coral. It also scares off the wildlife. Boats also go by and break off bits of coral. Overfishing. Overfishing is when people fish too much. At the Great Barrier Reef, if you, you are allowed to fish, but there are rules and limitations. Some people don't obey these rules and there are lots of people who fish. Fishing can damage the reef and cause a shift in the reef's ecosystem. Overfishing causes there to be less fish and is a certain and if a certain species is hunted it can become endangered. Pollution. Runoffs from farms can contain chemicals which reach the reef and pollute it. Oil spills is also a big problem because it causes because it kills all the marine life and birds. There was an oil spill in April 2010 in the Great Barrier Reef that spread three kilometres across the reef.